yeah my skin is doing something flows in the building she's she's doing her thing she's flowing she's annoying she's annoying me to death and today i made a decision today is my last day like getting an iced coffee from dunkin donuts for a while because i'm about to just make my own iced coffee at home like i'm just gonna make my own at home i can make it when when the kids first get up then i don't have to travel to go get it so um on my lunch break i'm gonna go to the store i'm gonna get everything to make my own stuff for iced coffee y'all know i always made that protein coffee so i think i might just go back to just make my own iced coffee protein coffee and i got the cute little straw or whatever now um maybe i just need a cute cup because i don't think i have any acute them cute cups like them cute clear cups i don't have any of those um maybe i'll see if they have any cute clear cups i'll buy one of those too but i have my starbucks cup but you can't see through them they're not clear and yeah i'm that like person that's like I, I want the clear cup but it's really foggy out i drop uh the kids off at school christian has a virtual appointment because his tubes have to get removed from his ears i don't think i really spoke on it too much but he has his tube never one of his tubes never fell out and because it never fell out he keeps getting ear infections um, so they have to remove that. So he has a virtual appointment about scheduling a surgery date because we got to get that tube out so he can stop getting all these ear infections. They upped his medication. I have to go to the doctor today because they sent the wrong medication. But, yeah, that's all that's really going on. Yesterday I worked from home. Um, everybody in the office keeps getting sick and it's just like, and I seen this TikTok and this TikTok was real life though. It kept showing how in the beginning of COVID, when COVID first happened, these jobs would let you be out. Like you got COVID symptoms, you stay home, blah, blah, blah. You know, you'll get paid. Hey, we understand, get better. And then they went to 2022. Oh, you got COVID symptoms. Oh, you can still come to work. You can still come to work. I'm gonna act like this call never happened. Um, or if you don't come to work, you don't get paid. And that's true. That's ha that's what has happened with C-19. At first, the jobs cared, and they cared about having employees safe. Now jobs care about what? Bottom line. And they're like, nah, nah. Yeah, right. we, we ain't even hear, hear you say you sick. And that's sad that a lot of jobs are not caring that people are sick. And the sad part above it all is, like, if you do have C-19, they're not paying. A lot of jobs are not paying anymore. They're making you go on leave without pay my job is one of those jobs they're like yeah before when you had c19 you can go and leave and you got paid for those two weeks of leave now you got c19 well there's 10 days no pay we're not paying you you sit at home you recover you don't get paid but i don't think that's fair and you can't say well they don't go outside I tell people don't go outside no they gotta go outside they gotta come to work because you are not are you y'all are kind of refusing people from working from home so you make these people go into the office so if they get sick because they went to your office and then you say oh i can't pay you for 10 days wait you can't pay me for 10 days when you cause the sickness where they do that at that makes no sense when the more than likely the only place let's say that person went was to work and they got sick on the job like i don't think that's fair like where are these jobs coming up with oh you can just take leave without pay when if somebody caught COVID at work like i would think that's like some kind of workman's comp case or something because if it was caused at work and you can prove you caught caught it at work you know what i mean like kenny has one of his friends one of his friend's wife died from covid uh, at the tail end of last year and she died because she caught covid at work one of the employees came to work sick sick found out that they had COVID, told the job they had COVID. By the time, you know, they found out and stuff, she already contracted COVID and she died. And she has young children, I think three or four children. And she, and she passed away from COVID because she caught it at that job. So I just, I just think the way they're treating COVID is like, oh, well, it's whatever. You're vaccinated, come to work. And it's never going to end. Like, I really feel C-19 is never going to end. It's never going to end because nobody cares. Nobody cares. They don't care. Nobody cares. Anyway, let me enjoy getting my... Ugh. Really? Y'all, it's all this. There's nowhere to even park. 
let me enjoy getting my last iced coffee um before i start making my own because starting tomorrow i'm just going to make my own so let's go Morning. and i love when they get it right you see this is the color consistency i'm looking for you know what i'm thinking you know what i'm thinking I, i'm thinking i'm going I'm sorry, I feel YouTube too much. I'm mean, not YouTube and TikTok too much. And then watching Carisha. Carisha. <laughs> Rolling Ray. <laughs> and Santana. <laughs> Santana. <but laughs> Rolling Ray is so stupid. Santana. <laughs> Carisha. <laughs> I'm sorry. But yeah, this is. You, but you know what I'm thinking seriously. I'm gonna save this cup. I'm gonna wash this cup. I'm not gonna use the straw, of course, because you need to throw the straws away. But I will use my, my reusable straw. And now I'm just gonna bake my old Dunkin' in what it is until I, my cup comes from Amazon. So I need to go on Amazon and order just in a new case, too. So, but you know what's funny? Now I have a free coffee available in my Dunkin' app. I guess it'll be a. Uh, next time I go to the hairdresser I'll use it kind of thing but yeah I'm gonna do that to save me some money so guys this is the outfit of the day I'm running late so I have to go but um this top is from boho boho whatever it's supposed to be like a little dress or whatever um now just with the black underneath instead of the top that's this color that goes with it just these black leggings um and these boots from tour no these are uggs those are uggs moccasins then I just have my LV to go with it. And then I'm wearing my LV earrings. And then I just put a thing at the top of my head like that. Um, that so yeah, what I'm looking like. Let me turn the light off. I got my gym bag here. So I got all my stuff in my gym bag. I use this Chanel bag. Uh, it's a beauty bag. But um, this is from Chanel Beauty. But I use it as my gym bag. And I put all my gym stuff in it. Then I got this regular bag right here that I'm about to put my lunch in because I want to put my lunch in nothing like really nice because, you know, lunches spill and make messes. I'm looking for my keys. Where is my keys? I think they're downstairs. Okay. I turn off the lights in my room. Shut my door. I don't, it don't matter how many times I shut my door and I shut my mom out my room. She always make her way back in there. I don't know how. Um, but let me show y'all my lunch. So I have basically cucumber with uh, some ranch with the tahini. Then I have pineapples. And this is just a piece of sausage that I'm going to eat with cucumbers. And I'm going to drink a whole bunch of water and try to make it a successful day. So let me go. I'll talk to you guys later. All right, guys, it is Wednesday and we are preparing for like this major storm um, that's supposed to be coming our way. So I'm on my way to pick Justin up because I'm going to make sure he's at school a little bit earlier because they start letting the kids in at 745. But um, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, they start letting the kids in at 745, but I'm going to, it's not 7, it's after 745. He'll get there about 810 to him this early. Well, the school starts at 820. He should be in the door anyway by 8, but he live on CP time. So, you know how that go. Um, but, um, yeah, I got to hit the grocery store. Um, because, you know, last time they was running out of food and stuff. Y'all remember when we had that bad winter storm and there was food, no food and all that stuff. So I can't let that happen this time around. I'm going to go ahead and get all the water, all the snacks, all the, the food, everything. Um, I end up taking that nail off. Thank goodness. I took it off last night. Like, I kept it on as long as I could. And then last night I had to take it off because the swelling started swelling up again. Like, again, it did. And I just had to let it go. Like, it's only one finger now. One. So I'm thinking that, cause I think this is the same one that had a cut in the nail. Then they put acrylic on the top of the cut. I 
stink and it got you know in my skin or something i i don't know but if i'm allergic to acrylic how am i allergic to acrylic and only one finger you know what i mean i don't know like someone's got to explain that to me but um i'm going to keep going with the benadryl and stuff and hope the swelling in my finger goes down i have just this mild case because i was watching youtube and the cases oh my goodness like some people's is a mess so mine isn't that bad so i'm just gonna find me some orange band-aids yes i am I'm gonna find me some orange band-aids uh to cover it up um i hated taking it off though because i'm like oh my god my nails were so pretty and it was a set and now i'm missing one and i look ghetto but who cares i need my nail to heal i need my finger to heal and i need my nail to breathe so i'm not even gonna put a band-aid on it today i'm just gonna let it breathe it needs to breathe um they talk about some they might let us work from home earlier today if it gets bad quick i don't know but i'm trying to get everything done before this rain and everything is about to act up and make the roads icy and the weather completely drops like texas has been weird the past couple of years guys like really weird but let me go get justin and i'll check in at the grocery store supposed to be um putting up my video i look like crap oh shoot but hey this is real life uh, i was supposed to be putting up my video today um this morning kids don't have school they cancel school for thursday and friday due to inclement weather and i went outside i'll show y'all and it's like icy and snow um i still have to work so kenny is over here because he's going to stay on the lower level with the kids that way I can work because they're out of school Thursday and Friday and I still have to work or I don't get paid. So yeah, Kenny is going to help out with the kids um, and help me with them. And then once like the ice part clears up, he's going to take them to his house so they can go to his house. So that's the plan. Um, Cause y'all know I, I don't do my kids on the weekend. I'm just saying, man, need my break, need my break. But yeah, it is icy out there and it's still coming down. We haven't lost power or anything. I don't think that's gonna happen at all. It wasn't like last year. And goodness, this lighting is doing nothing. Y'all, I gotta, it made me look like I got a whole five o'clock shadow and everything. I promise y'all I ain't got no beard. <sighs> but it is what it is. But let me show y'all out here. You're, you're going to fall. Bro, it's ice out here. So I told y'all I was going to do homemade ice coffee. Y'all thought I was playing? Uh-uh. Especially with the weather too. Perfect timing. Okay, perfect timing to start doing my own thing. Let me get my cute little straw out. Hold on, y'all. Where is it? I can use that silver one. Oh, the gold one is the same, so. Got my own little cute little straw. It's over. It's over for that. Okay, this is the same thing I order when I go to Dunkin'. And I'm just gonna make it myself. And guess what? I ain't gotta leave the house, okay? So I, I'm gonna use one Splenda. I don't even need the Splenda, but I'm gonna put one in it. I'm gonna use this, zero sugar, cause this has less than one carb. This has one carb. This has, I think, three carbs. Yeah, three carbs. I think this has no carbs. This has no carbs and the fat-free milk has carbs it has 12 but i'm talking i'm using very little of the milk because i don't like to really use milk so i'm gonna do that i need to use my nutribullet and just make like a frap but i ain't trying to do that and i got my gym pro so i'm just gonna add some gym pro to it too and just make it protein coffee so yeah 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 Take it away, take it away, feeling too good to me. 
Chilling all day, all in your space is where I wanna be. Here in this room, what did you do? I just can't get enough. Too caught up in your love. I've been trying to forget, but you won't let me. Something in my brain wants you. I've been hanging by myself, asking for help, but nothing seems to work on you. Yeah. break um i decided just to get on here and show y'all my skims haul my skims order came so i want to show you what i got from skims let me close that computer but yeah skims looks just like that and it's all chelsea's fault i told y'all i was binge watching chelsea on friday that got me in trouble and i knew she was going to get me in trouble because she's always like i don't know she's just so contagious it makes you feel girly and all this other stuff and y'all know this lighting is out of there okay there we go that's better turning it down just a little bit but yeah so i spent a little coin i ain't gonna cap this stuff was not cheap and it came in this little box i was like skims is high why is it in this little box but um what was this total it don't say on here but it started with a two that's all i'm gonna say and it comes just like this and I think I got a lot though for my money because they had the underwear on sale. So I picked up underwear and I got some bodysuits because I just love the way her bodysuits be looking um, when Chelsea's wearing her um, bodysuit in her video. So I picked up some as well because I just thought they looked really good and they look super comfortable and I want to be comfortable too. So let me open them up. So these are the underwear they look just like that and they ha are supposed to hold and support and give you control so they were three for 33 and it has the skins right there skins and they are what is this da -da -da. oh they're telling you this isn't made of plastic is what that was saying but my second pair of underwear and i love if y'all didn't know boy short underwear like that's my favorite cut is boy cut um the boy shorts they're my favorite and you could just wear them around the house you know when your kids ain't there or you know they sleep and it's just you in your room you can wear them or if you got a man your man can see you in them but i ain't got a man but yeah that's those so i got three of those i bought two body suits This is the first one. It was a little wrinkly. And these are extra larges. They oh, it's a small extra large. This is a small extra large, but it's you know, it can it fits over to you. So it'll stretch out, is what I'm trying to say. But um, yeah, it's wrinkly. It's a little wrinkle. Should have put it in a bigger box. So I got that one. And then I think this is the second one. Yeah, I think this is the color Chelsea has. I think, yeah, this brown one is the one she has. Um, I just love the way it looks on her. Like, I love it on her skin tone. Like, I love Chelsea's skin tone, though. I'm like, you know, I wish I just had one even skin tone. Like, I really do. But I have, like, four or five colors in my face, about three, four colors in my arm. I'm like, my, my body just don't know what it wanted to do. I don't know. I don't know. But this is really cute. And Chelsea was wearing this. And, like, I think this is one that she wears um, in her videos. And I just loved it on her. So, I bought me one, too. She be influencing me. That's why she's an influencer. She influences. And then I got a bodysuit. This was so... <laughs> this was not needed. But this is to wear around the house. It's, a, it's in the extra large. And... I, I can't justify buying this. I really can't, but I just wanted it. It's really cute. I had one like it before, and it was Playboy Bunny, um, but I don't know what ever happened to it. Like, I don't know what the moving process and everything, what happened to it. So, I got another one. 
and this is from skims and i kind of wish i would have just got a large instead of getting an extra large because this is kind of big and i didn't i thought their stuff would run small and it kind of some things do some things don't and i wish i would have just got this in a large but that means it's gonna be extra comfy and it's for sleep time so it don't matter and i just love that it's shorts because at night <sighs> pop myself in the head okay but at night i just like to be extra extra comfortable so yeah i'm so happy about this i like this i like this i like it a lot and it does look like my playboy bunny one my playboy bunny one that was a lot cheaper than this but the material feels really nice so it doesn't feel like it's going to be some you know like cheap material so that's good because skims is not cheap and i don't want no cheap material i do want to try their leggings a lot of people said their leggings are super super good and it holds your stomach in and it does what it needs to do so i would love to try the skims you know in the uh whatever but anyway i'm so tired y'all and then why we're about to have this three o'clock call i gotta do coachings after the call and then i gotta make more sales and then i gotta wrap up my day because when i wrap up my day i'm going to sleep i'm sorry kenny here he can watch his kids that's how i feel he here watching them and tomorrow they're going to his house so it's gonna be quiet in here when i work tomorrow i'm so happy but anyway let me get off here i'll talk to y'all in a little bit